Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to create your own Reddit community in 2023. Reddit is a popular platform where people with similar interests can come together. You can of course share content and engage in discussions. Create a Reddit community allows you to build, sorry, to build a community around a topic you're passionate about. So let's dive in. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So of course, the first thing that we'd like to start with is just to open whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. For me, I'm just going to use the Brave browser. Once I open my browser, I can simply go to this URL section and simply type Reddit and hit the enter button. As you can see, I'll find here Reddit, so I'll simply have to click on it. And here we are. Of course, if you have an account for yourself, you'll have to log in into it. And if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create your own account. That will take for you just one minute and it will not be very hard to do. And of course, then just remember that before creating your own community, it's important to explore existing communities on Reddit. Search for topics or interests that align with the community you want to create. This will help you understand what already exists and how you can different shades your community and of course once you are familiar with existing communities it's time to create your own on reddit homepage. of course you'll have to click on your reddit profile icon at the top right corner and simply click on create community you will find this right here of course from the drop down menu you will have to fill in the details such as the community name description and community type and choose a name that represents your community well and write a compelling description to attract members as an example let's say here i'm just going to talk about uh, uh, help people uh, with creating okay i actually have just 21 characters so i cannot pass them so let's just type this as an example because i'm not worried about the name so much and of course as you can see if this test is taken as you can see as you, they will tell it you here yeah as you can see sorry uh r slash test is taken so try another one so you can add the zero as an example and if it's taken add another zero and if that's taken add the one or and add some random numbers as an example so let's just do this if it's taken again we can change it so Okay, it's taken, so let's just do this as an example. And let's wish it's not taken. Yeah, as you can see, it's not taken. So here you'll have to choose the community type. You, you would like to be public. As you can see, anyone can view posts and comments on this community. Or you want it to be restricted. Anyone can view this community, but only approved users can post. Or you want it to be private, only approved users can view and submit to this community. Of course, if you have a plus 18 community are go going to talk about the subject this is plus 18 make sure to check this button so people will be notified if they don't want to see nsfw content which is not safe for work so let's an example for me i'm just going to do what's public and simply click on create community so here as you can see we can create our new posts or our first post as you can see welcome to the new community which is the name of it is this and set the tone of your community and welcome to new members with a post. So let's just create a post as an example. Of course, the post could be like a normal text, could be an image, could be a link, could be a pool. So you can do whatever you want as an example. Let's say I'm just going to do the title again. And the text is going to be hello everyone as an example. Everyone, I am just testing, I am just testing the reddit communities communities is an example and here of course we can add those options which is spoiler or nsfw if your uh, text or image or whatever it is it is a spoiler for a film a movie uh, an anime or something like that make sure to add this so people will be notified it is a spoiler and if it's not safe for work make sure to add this as an example if it's an adult content once you're done, you can simply click on post and then you'll find it on your community right here. 
and of course you'll be able even to set your community rules and guidelines is because setting your community rules and guidelines is essential for maintaining a healthy and engaging community think about what kind of behavior you want to encourage and what content is allowed you can define rules around respect self-promotion spam and another important aspects clearly or clearly communicate these rules to your members to ensure a positive community experience then you will have to promote your community and engage with members once your community is set up it's time to promote it and attract members you can share the link to your community on reveal or relevant subreddits as an example, social media like Instagram, Facebook, uh, any social media platform, maybe TikTok or something like that, and any other channel where your target audience might be engaged with your members by starting discussions. Responding to comments, of course, will help you as well doing that and encouraging participation. And of course, as you can see here, you can add some community topics as an example. Tell us what topics are relevant to your community so we can surface it to the right users as an example. And here you'll be able to see your uh, posts as an example on your community. You'll be able to create more posts from here. You'll be able to add some descriptions. You'll be able to edit some of it as you can see you can find here the members of it for me i am the only member now and you can see the community topics as you can see adding community topics allow people to find your community and add the primary topics and subtopics to be discovered more easily you can add them from here add a primary topic then some uh sub topics then of course you can uh, add or change this community option community theme you can uh, turn it on or turn it off choose whatever suits you, then you can even uh, send a message to the mods or moderators. For me, I am the only member in this uh, community, so I am the only moderator as an example. But for you, of course, if you have a lot of people in your community, you would like to add some moderators to maintain everything healthy and very good. If something happens, you are not there, they will be there to help you. Of course, you can see from here all the moderators and you'll be able to message them if you have any issues or something like that. And of course, if you like go down or something, you can always click here to back to the top or the first post of the community. And you'll be kind of good to go. So uh, I guess I said everything. Of course, you can even add some comments to the post. You can share uh, the post as an example. You can improve it. You can approve some posts if you are a moderator, as an example. If you want to approve them to let other people see them, you can remove them. If you don't want the post to be uh, posted in your community, you can report to spam and you can tip or do a lot of other stuff uh, like it is in post, save it, hide it, delete it, make a spoiler, make as an FW, which is not safe for work and etc. So as an example, let's just approve it. And here we are. So that's it. You've learned how to create your own Reddit community in 2023. Building a community takes time and effort, but with the right approach and engagement, you can create a Drive in space for people to connect and share with interests. So go ahead and start building your Redis community today. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more helpful content and I will see you in the next one.